I get a question all the time from fathers and mothers. How can I make every day count? And I tell you, one of the things that I like to do in the morning is I like to read my mission statement, my personal mission statement, which is to be a loving teacher and example of simple truths that helps and motivates myself and others to awaken the presence of God in our lives. Because I think the biggest addiction in the world is the human ego where we're edging God out. And then secondly, I like to read my obituary. A lot of people say, obituary, what are you gonna do that? Well, Alfred Nobel, I read a number of years ago, his brother died in the turn of the last century. And he went to get the newspaper in Stockholm, Sweden to read about his brother. And they got he and his brother mixed up and he got to read his own obituary. And some of you might have learned in high school that Alfred Nobel was involved in the invention of dynamite. So what do you think his obituary is mainly about destruction and all that? He was absolutely blown away that that's how he would be remembered. So he gathered friends and loved ones around him and said, what's the opposite of destruction? And they said, peace. And so he redesigned his life so that when he would die at Alfred Nobel, would be known for peace. And so you need to say, what, how do you want to be live? Write your own obituary. It sounds really crazy, but when you die, it'd be nice if somebody read it to you. Uh, I read it for you. And then finally, then I read my own personal values, which are spiritual peace, integrity, love, and joy. Uh, and those are ones that I guide. And then what I do is, if I read those early in the morning before I head out, how can I live my day consistent with those? And then at night, I look at those and I have a little journal where I write praisings. What did I do today that's consistent with who I want to be in the world? And then redirections, which is what did I do today that I wish I could have replayed, which might tell me who I need to apologize to for. So in order to make your days count, you first have to have a vision of who you want to be in the world. So when you go out that day, you can make it count because it's consistent with who you want to be.